So how would adult use change medical use? Well, there are many ways that I can't really get into now, but I want to point out that legalization of adult use could help expand the medical cannabis program. Because in order to qualify for our medical cannabis program, you have to have a condition that's on the, a list of qualifying conditions. So by opening it up just to adult use, more patients could have access to it, using it as medicine. Great. Access without stigma. Oh, hopefully. I, that is so much. Yeah. yeah. There's, there's still always going to be a lot of stigma, but we're, we're working on that. Yeah, absolutely. Right. So that auntie who's bed bound mm -hmm. has no caregiver and has no card and knows that cannabis in her youth helped her with her aches and pains. Mm -hmm. She can have somebody bring it to her as well without the stigma of it being illegal. Mm -hmm. And people use cannabis for so many reasons beyond just getting high. And I, well, I don't know. I, I think most use is medical use. Just even stress management, stress relief. But look how many stress-related illnesses we have. How is that not medical? So anyway, I'm fighting for adult use because I feel that all responsible adults should have access to a substance, legal access to a, to a substance that's safer than alcohol. I don't drink alcohol because I don't put poison in my body. And I don't consider cannabis to be toxic. So I think it should be therefore, <laughs> you know, every responsible adult's choice. They should have freedom of choice. Wonderful.